Hey, what's up? It's the BAM, and it's going down in my DMs. My husband probably DMs me more than anybody on Instagram. We are in each other DMs all day long. We send each other like funny memes and stuff, and then sometimes, you know, I don't know if he's looking fine, I just might want to slide in his DM and tell him. <laughs> so, of course, I have hundreds or maybe even thousands of DMs. Most of them are pretty nice, but some of them are really weird. Here's one I got today. It says, um, it's funny how you reality stars think you're all that. I can look just as good if I had money too. I mean, I just feel like that's so childish. I have a overload of moms like DMing me now. They're giving me advice and they're asking me for advice. And um, sometimes it's a little overwhelming because they're like telling me, they're giving me unsolicited advice actually. And I'm just like, girl, like I know it takes a village, but like you're not a part of my village. You know, I have my own village, it's okay. This one is really funny. Yo, little shorty, you fine though. I won't tell scrap, I promise, on my five kids. First of all, it was just so much wrong with this message. He's blocked, of course, but first of all, I'm not a shorty, you know, clearly, like 5'11". And he promised on his five kids. Like, he just lost me completely. But anyways, those are the types of DMs I get. Sometimes I share, like, the ridiculous DMs with my husband, but most of the time, they're so ridiculous that I just block them and move on to the next. I don't know if I've had any DM disasters, but a couple of times, like maybe a couple years ago, I would actually like screenshot them and post them to my page just so people would not send me ridiculous stuff. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, okay, maybe if they see me like putting people on blast, they would chill out. But um, you know, like the, the pictures of the privates and that kind of stuff, like it's just, you know, I have put some of that stuff on blast, I have. I think nudes and DMs is like the most disrespectful thing ever because I'm opening up these messages because I'm thinking it's like maybe a fan or a supporter or something and then I just open it up and it's just offensive, you know? Like I don't wanna see that. I would say the do's and don'ts of the DM is don't ask people for money because some people they don't even need it they'll, they'll just say oh I have a bet with my friend I'm trying to see if I can get 10 people to send me like it's just like so rude and ridiculous don't send unsolicited advice don't send nudes well obviously when you open your DM you can see the first like line or so so if you want to get my attention, I don't know, it's just so random, you know what I'm saying? Like some people have a, a, a way with words and you know, they come off like they don't mean any harm. And you can see that from the first couple of lines, so then I'll open it up. But if right off the bat you come in like, I usually don't do this, but I'm not gonna open it. If you say something like, I know you probably won't see this, I'm not gonna open it because you know, you're putting out that negative energy. So I'm just not gonna look at it anyway. Before I was married, I. I never slid into DMs. Like that's just something that I would not do. I'd probably be a little nervous to do that anyway, maybe thinking it's not that person that I'm talking to. So yeah, no, that's not my thing. Never has been. I don't think any of my cast members have slid into my DM, not on anything inappropriate, no. I think they're a little um, intimidated. They already know, even if me and Scrap hadn't been together, they probably knew it was a possibility that we would get back together. So no, no sliding in the DMs from the cast members. So if you're gonna slide into somebody's DM trying to get a date, the first thing you should probably do is ask her what's her cash app handle. That'll get you a date. Celebrity I wish would slide into my DM. Maybe Beyonce? I don't even think she'd be on her Instagram for real. But if anybody had to slide in my DM, you know what I'm saying? She can send me something, you know, say what's cracking. That's it. Everybody else is so accessible, you know what I'm saying? Be Beyonce is just like, she's like, you know, not even real. She's not even human. So the other day I posted a video of my son and he was like taking a little cat nap on the couch and all my little nieces and nephews were around him. So that day I got a few 
comments, you know, people trolling, telling me I was like a horrible mother and, you know, I don't know anything about being a parent. You know, sometimes you get people trolling. And I'm, I'm pretty sure it's the people that you block and then they'll go to their backup page and then come in your DM and, you know, try to say whatever they want to say the first time they got blocked. So I used to respond to all things negative. Like I had a clap back for everything, but now I try to just block them and move on. But sometimes you'll just have that one person that just needs to be told. And sometimes, you know, I say what I gotta say and then I block them. The messages that I receive most in my DM are women asking me, how did you get this guy to completely change his whole entire persona, like when it comes to dealing with, you know, women or you, me, whatever. But I get all these women asking me like, well, how did, how did you get him to change? And you know, what did you do? And all these questions. And sometimes I answer and I'm like, you know, like girl, that's the problem right there. Like you're trying to make somebody change and it's not gonna happen. So, you know, you're just gonna have to let your guy figure it out. And don't stick around too long, you know what I'm saying? If he's doing too much, keep it moving. Yeah, sometimes I give advice and DMs to these young ladies because I feel like, you know, it's a lot of young girls and they are so lost. And if I can, if I see them like going in a, a wrong direction, then, you know, I'll try to throw them a little advice, but you know, I'm not trying to be Dr. Phil or anything like that. What's up? It's The Bam, and you're watching Down in the DMs on BET.com.